Hello friends, welcome back to SQL with Manoj. Today in this video, we'll see how to move master database to another drive. In my previous videos, we saw how to move a temp database and how to move user databases from one drive to another drive. Moving master database is a bit some tricky and not the way we did for you know TempDB and user databases. So with master database, we don't have to use the alter database statement. If you end up using alter database statement, then you might face uh, different issues so it's a bit different so the step here goes like this uh, you have to change the master database uh, uh, location by using SQL Server Configuration Manager or SSCM um, there you have to go to services change the pro check the properties and uh, you know uh, change these parameter for change these parameters for the database and log files stop the SQL service move the master database files manually and start the SQL Server service. So first of all, let's see, you know, what is the database location of our master database? It is uh, this master. I'll just copy them for our future reference and just to make sure we went fine or not. Okay, now, so this has to done graphically by GUI. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll go to start menu and go to the SQL Server main SQL Server location. This Microsoft SQL Server 2014 and SQL Server 2014 Configuration Manager. Okay, I'll open it. So this opens SQL Server Configuration Manager for you. Go to the SQL Server service and this is the SQL Server service that is running. So here you have to go to properties. Okay, in properties you have to go to startup parameters. Tab, a startup parameter tab if you see here, this first is the D and and uh, you have to skip this this is the error log and the third one is the l so this is the data file location for master.mdf and this is the l for the master log file so master log file is mast log.ldf and uh, if you see here hyphen d then uh, after d without a space you have the full file location and similarly for the log file after l hyphen L you without spaces you have the full file location right so here we have to move this to this location so what we'll do is I'll copy this and you know paste it here till data okay so this is my uh, log file location looks like so I'll update it it is updated now and similarly over here I'll update this path as well okay so and I'll update it as well so as soon as I update them you can see the existing parameters are updated now I'll just apply it says that any changes made will be saved however they will not take effect until the service is stopped and restarted okay I'll click OK and click OK now I have done all this so it says to stop the service so to stop the service I'll go to run and services.msc I'll go to SQL Server I'll stop the service okay after stopping the service I have to go to this location where my master file is located copy and in run I'll paste this I have to manually copy the master and master log file I'll cut them and you know take them to the new location I'll paste them here okay so here the master log file are nowhere now and I will so I've moved it I, I can restart the SQL server service now so restarting like I can just do a start so the SQL server services will be restarted okay now I will refresh it and we can see you know our database is up and running and just to make sure we are you know on the correct path so here you can see the these are the new master log files and data files so we have successfully moved the master database from D drive to E drive uh, okay one thing more uh, to stop the service and start we can also do it from the SQL Server Configuration Manager we opened the services window separately uh, you don't have to do it we can do it right directly from here you know after we 
change the startup parameters right so after we are we have changed from D to E and we click OK we can just you know uh, do a stop and start from here also okay so this is it for today and uh, let me know if you have any comments or any suggestion regarding these videos please like the video if you really like it please subscribe thanks a lot have a nice day and stay tuned for my new videos